So this was a great, I just like lost power for a second because the freaking thunderstorm came back. Come on. and Ken's welcome back to the channel our channel and if you're new here my name is Gab and it might be a rainy day outside but in my room it is not cloudy I have a bunch of new quarantine online shopping clothes that I got because like the rest of us I'm bored just like you so I am so excited to show you some of the really cute pieces that I got if you guys like this video please as always thumbs it up and subscribe down below to become a Barbie or a Ken. And I want to get into some of the cute odds and ends that I had purchased. Some of them I have bought already so I can give you some pretty fair, uh, reasonable opinions on the pieces. Uh, for instance, with the one I have on, but I also might be selling some stuff, so check out my eBay because I know that a couple odds and ends in clothes because I was going for my closet the other day, I added on there as well. So if you're a small, extra small, medium, totally check it out, or if you like handbags and accessories. But uh, let's get into it. This first one I'm actually thinking about putting on to eBay just because it's a little small at the top. Um, my bra is like right here and it kind of just wants to like slide down on me. If I would have got a medium, I think I would have fit in a little bit better in it. Uh, but this was a small and I normally fit in extra small, small. So I'm not sure exactly what happened with this one. And I thought I was going to love it so much. And it's kind of flattering with a strapless bra, but I'm probably going to end up putting this on my eBay and my Depop just because it's not right for me. <laughs> crack because I don't know if it's supposed to be like that like is it supposed to be that you see the indentation of your butthole like I don't think it's supposed to so then yeah but it's like flattering from the front that's what sucks the sun keeps going in and out sort of and I'm just like or it's getting like brighter and then more like gloomy and then brighter and I'm just like do I keep filming should I try to make it work? I mean, it looks bright on the screen right now, so that makes me feel a little bit better. But yeah, this, I'm probably, you're gonna find this on uh, my social medias for sale because it just fits me weird. And it's flattering from like different angles, but not as a whole, at least on me. <laughs> By the way, if you're wondering, that was from Forever 21. So these are also from Forever 21. And I'm gonna have like stuff on the side screen if you wanna purchase uh, down below in my description box. But there are these like ribbed shorts and I'm obsessed with them. I'm mad I didn't get more shorts from Forever 21. They're such like a nice cottony feel and I wore these out the one day and they were so comfortable on me. And then this bodysuit is adorable. I love the pattern on it. I think it's so freaking cute. The only problem is uh, these keep sticking out, which I could always just cut them. But this is such a cute bodysuit. And I'm starting to try to get used to bodysuits because of my illness. The snaps near my crotch, they just feel questionable. And I like that you can wear this off the shoulder too. It kind of does fall off the shoulder a little bit. You don't have to wear it traditionally up on your shoulders. So I like that about it. Oh my god, this rain is wild right now. I wish you could see it, but I don't know. Whenever I film rain, it doesn't ever look as violent as it actually is, but like it's splashing in buckets. I mean, usually when I film videos and it's raining, you can't hear it, and I'm 100% sure you can hear it. 
Man, it's making it brighter in here, so I don't really mind. <laughs> but I'm going to show you how this looks together. Putting it on. dress I'm absolutely in love with. I love velvety dresses and this is definitely one for the books. So freaking pretty. I got something similar to this from Forever 21 December and to be honest I hated it. It looked terrible on me. It was velvet but it had straps like this that were chunkier and like a wrap to it and it just looked terrible on me. This is more of a skater skirt which I'll show you then. So I ended up giving the other one which was more of like a burgundy to my friend, my best friend Miley. She looks so pretty in it and I saw this and I was like oh my gosh this is kind of similar to what I had from them. I should purchase it and see what it's all about. Straps could be a little bit tighter in the back. I was still trying to adjust and finish um, fixing those myself. It's kind of difficult. I'm going to have my boyfriend fix it when he gets home later, but the front cut of it is really cute. I have a hard time finding low cut items for tiny boobies that kind of look flattering and fit nice. So this definitely was something that I thought did both of those and the back is really cool in it. <laughs> and it's actually like bright and sunny out do you see this you can probably tell the difference between clips wow hi this was the dress that made me want to even do a forever 21 order uh you know how you're scrolling on facebook and if you were on a different site or something it'll be like here's an ad buy this this dress was on there and i was like forever 21 has that like that's like my aesthetic that's very 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 cute so i got it and I got this on clearance too, which was nice or like a sale price. So there's two ways of wearing it, which I'll show you in the video then of me like modeling it. Well, brain one like, but yeah, it's a little big in the cup area for me. But when I have these up, it all stays together and holds really nice. But you can also wear it like this off the shoulder for just like a really elegant, cute look. I don't own anything like that, which is fun because I don't normally have the boobies for it to stay up. But today, this is looking okay with the bra I have on. So we'll have to see. And this bra that I have on, by the way, it like slips in the back. So I'm always feeling like I'm like hiking it up. So if you guys have any bras, they're strapless and you have small boobs and you enjoy them, let me know in the comments what they are so I can check them out myself.
jumper is so cute. I'm convinced that I need to get another one. So this was from Amazon. I don't normally shop on Amazon for clothes ever. I look at the handbags, stuff like that, the jewelry that's real cheap, but I don't ever get anything. This, I was like, eh, let's film a quarantine clothing video. And I was like, it is so freaking cute. And you can wear any shirt underneath it, which is so fun. It's even big enough in here, which is nice. So you could do a sweater with it too. Uh, it's just, it tucks in real nice. And I'll have to show you then. I wish my only concern was an extra small would have been cool. I got a small, maybe it's supposed to fit bigger on you like this, but the proportions and how it hits and where it hits on me, like where my knee is to uh, where it ends, I like it. I think it's really nice. So let me show it to you guys. <laughs> offering some stuff to show you from Dolls Kill. I love Dolls Kill, very unique, cute stuff. And I'm gonna start with the lingerie and then work backwards. Uh, and when I show you this outfit, I did put underwear on underneath just in case, cause it's a teeny bit of revealing. Revealing. Short of my brain right now. But I love this so much. I love Dolls Kill lingerie because one, it fits me. I'm like a 32A and a half, like flat in that. Like I got little bitties. So it's really hard for me to find cute lingerie that's affordable, but also, you know, fits, it's comfortable and it looks flattering on me and it doesn't have that like little gap part. So this is so beautiful on me. I love the color and a little bit more orangey and neon-y in person. But I got it for a photo shoot. I thought it would just be so fun to do some pictures in this. And it makes me feel like so girly and cute. <laughs> was such a great sale price so I had to pick it up and it kind of reminds me of Sailor Moon vibes I don't know about you I showed it to my one friend and she was like oh my god are you gonna do a photo shoot in that and I was like I wasn't gonna but now I want to and you guessed it a Sabrina Sailor Moon kind of-esque photo shoot would be really fun in this bra because first glance I feel like just looking at it reminds you of Sailor Moon <laughs> this was a steal i remember when this first came out and i was like i think i like it but it's a little bit too pricey i usually go on dolls kill for like two main brands club exx and sugar frills and this is club exx i cannot wait for you to see the whole like skirt and everything of this it is so soft so beautiful i have worn this out already and i got compliment after compliment after compliment on it no crap i have been wearing it with that rainbow shirt that i had on with my other little overall uh i had that underneath it already i had like a velvety cut off shirt to here and then i tried putting on a longer sleeve to see how it would look with it the only thing that i do not like it with is sweaters it's just a little too bulky in here and it feels weird <laughs>
so this last piece I actually got for my birthday. Hopefully we're not still in quarantine and I can wear it out somewhere or after the fact I'll wear it somewhere, but it's just really pretty. It ties here. I like to have it more in the back, but I wasn't able to because I'm, there's no one here for me to tie it. So I didn't tie it myself in the front more, but it's this like satiny, ooh, it feels so nice and it feels nice on sunflower dress and I was like I can't live without that like that was made for me and it fits me like a glove I'm obsessed with it it's beautiful on and I can't wait for you guys to see pictures of it it's super pretty <laughs> So that is all of the outfits I got online during quarantine that I just felt like I couldn't live without. Let me know in the comments down below which one was your favorite. And if you guys like the video again, please thumbs it up, subscribe down below, become a glow we are again. And I should probably wrap this up because now it's laid out again and then I feel like it's going to hail and get dark and my power already flashed once. So that was my warning. Okay. I love you guys. Bye.